Let's try this again now that we've uh, fast traveled back to Lincolnshire. Need to cloak myself here. Shit, the blue Ow! That would have hurt the shins. Eivor! What news? Your father is dead. Wait, what? The sigil of Hunbeor's house. I found it near his body. No. No, this cannot be. He was strong, a pillar of Lincolnshire. He cannot be gone. He... He... <laughs> oh, you poor boy. I'm so, so sorry. I am a man, Archer. Do you hear me? I am a man and I am my father's son. Do not forget it. Keep steady, Hunwald. You are now the head of your house. Another swan takes flight. Only I remain, last in a line of dwindling nobles. I'm sorry, Hunwald. I had already asked a priest to administer last rites when your father disappeared. What? I didn't tell you sooner because I... I thought by some miracle he had survived. You lied to me! You silly, sobbing moon calf. Will you never grow up? Huh. Lord have mercy on that woman. She should have said something. It was her duty to say something. Wow. Hunwal was the son of an elderman. Will he take his father's seat? The title's not hereditary, but he can plead his case before a shire moot. King Chaelwulf must then ratify the decision. Explain how this works, your shire moot. A moot is a meeting of lords. We convene from time to time to steer the course of our shire. It was always my intention to convene a moot, but between our troubles in Lincoln and the bandits' raids, we slipped into a pattern of convenience. Someone in the Shire wants Hunwald dead. If I have to assemble an army to make sure this meeting is not an ambush, I will. The Shire mood is a lawful, godly assembly. Mm -hmm. Hunwald will be safe, as will you be. Apart from Hunwald, who else will stand for the Elderman's seat? If I may be so bold, I should like to put my name forward. Uh -huh. Under my care, this Shire has found some peace this past month. I will offer my name as well. My family has ancient ties to this land. And I am proud to say I have forged quite a friendship with the Danes to the north. Good. My priests will spread word of the moot across the Shire and will convene in a few days' time. Uh, do visit my estate, Eivor. I have something for you. Something I think you'll enjoy. I'll find the time. Eivor. A word, if you don't mind. Is the word Christ or pagan? <laughs> oh, I deeply regret my churlish ways when we first met. I did not treat you as my God commands, with kindness and love. Love is a difficult feeling to command. Yes, quite. In any case, thank you for putting this mystery to rest. I do hope we'll see you at the moot. My ponytail there. With Hunbeor's death an open secret, Hunbol's enemies may strike again. I should find him before they do. Archer, I took a 
console him. I should follow her. Hmm. Well, we will devastate with him. Okay, I should do this in order. Best of luck at the coming Shyamut, Bishop. I would tell you my fate is in the hands of our Lord, but somehow I believe that won't be the whole story. You fear something? I fear everything these days, in small doses. Where are the stairs? I'm welcome, so I can run out the front door, but this is faster. Calves of steel. Archer, where is Hunwald? I tried to console him, but he pushed me away. Whoa. I love the boy, I do. But I fear what would happen if he took his father's title. He's fragile and scattered. I saw him ride north, following the paved Roman road, to the old tall tree where he often passed time with his father, I imagine. Hunwald loved you like family, and you lied to his face. In my way, I was trying to protect him. Oh, Saint Cuthbert, give me strength. Oaths and ale work better than your prayers and saints. Ooh, damn. Good horse. That must be the tree Atcha mentioned. Hunwald may be nearby. These woods, father. Oh, these woods. I remember the days we spent here together. Here, upon this spot. Ducking and hiding through the rushes. With bow and arrow. <laughs> Hello? Eivor? Is that you? Eivor, what a pleasant surprise. Would you drink with me? Unwald. Come, s sit, sit. Stay with me a while and contemplate... 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 The view.
Let's have a drink. To the memory of your father. Here we go, sailing among the leaves so green. Do not gorge on grief, nor give in to sadness. But let your aching love light the meat of your eyes, and lead you to triumph. That is quite lovely. My father would have liked you. He liked all those who could swing a sword and speak a verse with ease. <laughs> He had a large heart and a love for his people. I think I would have liked him too. <laughs> he and I used to wander up this way all the time. He would take me hunting, and I would catch the m most wretched little things if I caught anything at all. I was a rubbish hunter. <laughs> but he always said he was proud. Each and every time. A toast. To your father, Lord Hunbeorth of Lincolnshire. He may have dwindled from this world in death, but in life he was as stalwart as this tree. The wife's old oak. Yes. Skull. Skull. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then, my father says, it's the right goat, but it's the wrong end. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my Swanborough loves that one. <laughs> she has a great sense of humor, my lady love. Father would have liked her. Right. Your Dane lady love, she sounds lovely. Too lovely to be real. You know what? We should visit her. We should go to Brimsky, uh, G uh, Grimsby. Yes, yes, there's no time to lose. Uh -oh. After you. Nothing like drinking and riding to jostle your troubles away. And the contents of your gut. Should never drink and ride, sir. Now come and enjoy the splendor of my shire. You Saxons and your tiny splendor. You have never seen mountains, have you? Or deep fjords like a giant's axe wound. Or towering falls that steam in the dead of winter. Snow sparkling like a blanket of jewels. That is splendor. Well, if your homeland is so splendorful, why come to England at all? You cannot grow crops on a blanket of jewels. Ha! Ah, very true. I'll admit, your countryside does take the breath away. Quite so, quite so. I love this land. And should I follow my father's footsteps, I shall do my solemn duty to protect her. I know many think me foolish and experienced, but I would ask that they judge me by my future hopes, not my past reputation. If I am given sway over this land and show myself to be a poor leader, shame me, punish me, of course. But give me that chance. My God, I just want to have that chance. that birds Eivor has no one told them today is a day of grief Shh. quiet stop here something isn't right I'll find the trouble before it finds us
Not highlighting them. That's twice they tried to kill you, Hunwald. And twice failed! We had luck, but if you're not more careful, they will succeed. Someone in Mercia wants you dead, and they'll kill anyone in the way to see it done. Yes, including my dear Swanborough, my lady love. Come, let us hurry away! I am serious, Hunwald. Are you hearing me? Plain and clear. Follow me! Hunwald, are you sure this place is safe? The safest spot in the Shire, yes. Here I am with a chance to be Elderman, but I have yet to prove myself worthy. To you, to the Shire, to her. I can do nothing without my darling lady. You've made me realize how much I've neglected her through this fatal stupor of mine. This I must see for myself. Mm. Bro, why'd you get off your horse? There we go. Grinsby looks deserted. Oh. Can you hear me? <laughs> oh, thank the heavens. There she is. The beefy lass. Hundval. <laughs> I thought for sure you'd be dead. Why didn't you send word? It has been far too long, my little jewel. I'm so very sorry for that. I'm fine, my love. I wilted without you, but still I grow. And who is this? Ah, yes. I am proud to present Eivor of the Raven Clan. Hello, Eivor. A pleasure to meet you. And you, Swanborough. I wasn't sure what to make of Hunwald's stories, yet here you are. Surprised to find a Dane by his side? Not quite. I'm surprised to find a Saxon at yours. Hunwald seems to endear himself to all sorts. <laughs> Eivor agreed to help me find my father. But I'm afraid it hasn't gone as well as I'd hoped. What's happened? My father is dead. Died of a cruel disease, apparently. Then shunted off to a cellar for burial. Oh, my love, I'm sorry. And someone in your shire wants to make sure Hunwald follows his father to the grave. Let them try. I'll cut their throats. A shire mood will soon be held. Hunwald should stay here out of sight until he can attend. What if I left it all behind, my love? Forget my father's seat. What if I stayed here with you? Just the two of us. Hunwald, no. This Shire must be led with courage and heart. Follow in your father's footsteps and lead the Shire as he did. Whatever strength you lack, you have in Swanborough. Heed her advice. Yes. If anyone can lift my spirits in time for the Shire moot, it's you, my dear. Come inside and rest your bumbling bones, love. Be well, Eivor, and thank you. 
Keep watch over that one. Men have come for him more than once. My blade will keep him safe. I do not doubt it. Hmm. Here. Wait, what? I've gone through much trouble and sure this other finds you, but need you know that I am right that I did not leave you apart. Exiled. Looking for someone? My husband. He was not supposed to leave home on his own. I fear he has fallen asleep somewhere. Fallen asleep? Yes. A curse he has carried his whole life. At any moment, his eyes roll back and his body simply collapses. Dangerous to be out there on his own. Extreme you narcolepsy? Think he gotten far. His bag is gone. I fear he may have taken it to go fruit picking down south near the old ruins. Pjarti, where are you? I will keep an eye out for him. Thank you. He snores, if that helps. Pjarti! Pjarti! Come! Well, that's an animal. Okay. So, I guess that's what... I guess we'll go get... We'll go get that. Just to expose the map. Another legendary animal. I mean, I don't know what. I'm not familiar with these. Is that a hyena? What is that? Wolf is that? Huh. 
All of a sudden, Avor's moving like super slow. We'll give it one shot. Oh, that was bullshit. Thanks, camera. Camera. Cheap shoddy. Gotcha. Glad your thread is ended. That was a little bit wee bit on the cheap shoddy side. But cricket wolfhead. Never heard of this Gimma Wolf or whatever. Alright. Well, that's gonna do it for tonight.